I am on day 1297. Welcome to another OMAD vlog. I'm Dr. Erica and I have lost and kept off 60 pounds for over three years through intermittent fasting and also through exercise. I also like to help encourage and motivate you while you're on your journey. If that sounds like something you're interested in, sis, go ahead and click the subscribe button and join the family. I promise you'll love it here. Today is Tuesday, January the 30th and I am ready to have an amazing day. Today, I am on day 1297. Girl, 1297 days in a row of me. Your girl showing up for herself every single day because see, I made myself a priority. I am definitely important and self-care is not selfish. It's actually necessary. So let's go ahead and get into the word. The word for today, I got time. Yes, sis, I got time and I know it's someone out there that needs to hear that today. See, uh, girl, a lot of times, for me at least in the past, I would always use the excuse before, you know, going on the health and wellness journey or the reason why I couldn't start would be because I don't have time. Raise your hand if you know what I'm talking about. I don't have time. But here's the thing. We make time for the things that are important to us. And since I'm here to tell you, you are important. See, this is what I was doing. I was being everything for everybody else and leaving nothing for myself. Nothing. Girl, make that make sense. How am I out here being everything for everybody and nothing for myself? But the truth of the matter is you cannot pour from an empty cup. You should take care of yourself first so you can be the best version for everyone else. So I'm here to tell you, sis, make the time. You do have time. Make it because you are important. So are you looking for an accountability partner, girl? That's why I'm here. Not only do I show up for myself every day, I show up for you as well. You know, making these daily blogs. See, I'm going to gas you up. I'm going to hype you up. I will be your biggest cheerleader, making you believe you can do anything you put your mind to because you can. Now, I know it's someone out there that is ready to start their health and wellness journey. So if I'm talking to you, girl, I need you to do one thing. Because see, not only am I the queen of consistency, your girl is also the queen of walking in place. So go ahead, stand up. Start walking in place. Watch this entire vlog. And girl, guess what? Your exercise, your workout, your activity for day one is done. Congratulations on making today, this day, your day one. You know, the start of your health and wellness journey. Now, sis, you just got to keep going. Start showing up and showing out because that's what we do over here. Just like I said, you are important. So make yourself a, a, a priority. Girl, we shine and bright like a diamond. Once again, we got time today. We got time every day. Now it's time for me to head downstairs and get my workout in. Girl, come on.
so I just got done working out and girl, you already know it was a good one, but you also know how this works. Best friend, I need to know about your workout. Girl, what time are you working out? Um, what kind of workout you're doing? How long are you gonna work out for? Girl, what are you watching? What are you listening to? Girl, tell me what's it, what's up on your playlist? Because see, you know we gotta stay entertained while we're working out. Just tell us anything there is to know about your workout because that's what accountability partners do and that's what we are. Because just to know, girl, when you click this subscribe button and if you haven't uh what are you waiting on but when you click that subscribe button girl we are we are locked okay we will forever be showing up for each other as accountability partners girl consistency bffs so just like i said girl tell us anything there is to know about your workout so my workout was good so this morning i woke up at four o'clock i set the alarm because remember girl yesterday we had braylon's game on last night so at four o'clock i got up checked that sleep score girl it was an 80 okay which that is a little lower than you know what it normally would be but just like i said you know we went to braylon's game on last night which meant that your girl got in the bed a little later than you know my normal but nevertheless i still came down here girl making time for myself what did i say earlier girl making time for what's important i came down here i got my workout in so i started out on my treadmill i did my five minute walk for my warm-up and then i ran a little over six miles i think it was like 6.3 i think or some somewhere around there so a little over three a, a little over six miles for my cardio then um it was time for my resistance training once I got off. So I started off um, using my 15 pound kettlebell. I did some squats and then girl, I just picked up those resistance bands and did some little leg um, exercises. And when I tell you, girl, I was definitely feeling the burn, girl. Those resistance bands are so powerful, girl. They are small, but they pack a mighty punch, okay? So after my resistance, I just ended with my little cool down and stretch. So what was I watching? Okay, so I started off on YouTube, girl. I watched a couple of fasting videos. Then I went to Bravo and I finished up, well, I caught up on Housewives of Potomac. And then I went over to um, start watching, start to catch up on my Merit to Medicine. So that was my entertainment. So that's everything there is to know about my workout, girl. I am just looking forward to the most amazing day. So, um, yeah, girl, back at it again in the office. We'll see what today holds. The good thing is, though, um, today will be an update. So remember, um, I have to keep saying this, that yes, old man is my sweet spot. But I wanted to challenge myself, you know, to do a modified alternate day fasting schedule until my birthday, which, uh, yeah, will be on February the 14th. So we're almost there. Um, going on this little mini cut and I have been seeing the most amazing results. So today will be an update where you will see me eat um, at work around lunchtime, 12, 1, 2 o'clock. Whenever I do get hungry, I made my food last night. Girl, I'm just going to put that little lunch bag on my shoulder and we're going to be good to go. So real quick though, I just wanted to circle back on what we talked about earlier. Sis, make time for yourself. You are important. So make yourself a priority like I come on here and say every single day. Self-care is not selfish. It's actually necessary. And Lord knows you cannot pour from an empty cup. I found myself, girl, lost, okay? Mental health just suffering. And I realized it was because I was giving, giving, giving to everybody else and not giving anything to myself. So if I could just encourage you today, sis, make time. We got time today. We got time every day to pour into ourselves. Now, girl, I ain't gonna get to preaching, okay, on this here, on this day, okay? I'm about to head upstairs, okay? Start drinking on this water because you already know I like to go ahead and get about 20 ounces in before I even leave. So, um, start drinking on this water so I can get us out of here to school and to work. I'll just be checking in real soon, girl, once I get to work, maybe at our midday check-in. But let me know how your workout was. Hey girl, it is time for our midday check-in. Best friend girl, I know we coming from our little Tuesday location, okay? Um, that's if I'm not like, you know, in the car girl, if I haven't gone to Publix. But remember I told you how on Tuesdays, you know, um, the orthodontist is here, girl, the same one that's doing these Invisalign. So right now he is in um, my office and I, girl, I'm just like, look, I know he don't want to be listening to me talk to my best friend, girl. I'm just trying to let him eat his lunch in peace. So here we are, girl. 
girl in our Tuesday location. But girl, we have a lot to catch up on. But girl, okay, you go first. You go first. You already know, girl, this is one of my favorite times of the day where I can catch up with my best friend. So tell me how your morning is going, girl. How are you doing with your water? Are you on track to reach your goal, whatever that goal is? If you are not, girl, go ahead and take a couple of steps right now, okay? And then how are you doing with your steps? If you do track your steps, girl, if you are behind with your steps, go ahead right now, sis. Stand up, start walking in place because, girl, you know that's my cheat code, okay? That's how I get a lot of steps in the day. And then if you are a faster, how are you doing with your fast? Have you been feeling hungry? Are you feeling full? How long are you going to fast for? And then if you are about to break your fast, Girl, go ahead and tell us what you'll be eating because you know we want to know and you never do know who may get their next meal idea from what you're eating. Girl, just tell your best friends anything you want to tell us about how your morning is going. So, girl, how am I doing over here? Okay, let's go ahead and talk about the water. Girl, listen. Listen, we best friends, so, girl, no judgment. Girl, look at this water. As you can see, your girl is way behind on the water. When I tell you the only water that I have really had is the water that I had before I uh, left the house this morning. But it's a reason, okay? We're going to get to that in just a second, okay? But no water. Girl, I didn't had a couple of sips, but I definitely will be playing catch up here in the next little bit. And then as far as my steps, your girl is over 15,000 steps. So you already probably know where I'm going with this. So doing really good with the steps. And then as far as my fast so right now it is 12 38 so that means i'm over 16 hours fasted but remember you know these past couple of weeks not really counting the hours because girl we on this modified alternate day fasting okay but i haven't been feeling hungry at all you know i don't know girl i get listen i think there's a reason to that too as well but we're gonna get to that in just a second so i'll probably be breaking my fast i don't know girl a little later on later meaning in the next hour or two but i'm definitely not ready to eat right now so how has my morning been girl when i tell you your best friend has been so busy if you remember on yesterday i told you that i was busy on yesterday and remember we had like three teammates out girl ask me why we had four teammates out on today so you already know what that means girl when i tell you i have been moving and shaking all morning long so that's why girl i haven't had the chance to come in and drink water because i literally have not even been in the office so um yeah and that's the reason why your girl is on fifteen thousand steps because i've been going back and forth in the office it definitely made the morning go by super fast though so um yeah i'm excited about that but you already know girl my office manager, Val. You know, she's been on the blog several times before. Remember, she came in talking about her raw vegan, you know, experience. And y'all know Val, girl, the GOAT, okay? My office manager. Girl, we have been so busy to where she said, you know what? Let's just order lunch today. So y'all know that I had packed my lunch, made my lunch, and then packed it to bring today. But I will not be eating that, no ma'am. So I have my food in there. Of course, like when it's time to break my fast, I'll show you, you know, what it is. And I am looking forward to it. I'm just like, girl, that'll be a nice little treat. And I was thinking, you know what? That's going to save me for later because the food that I did bring to eat to lunch today, girl, we probably going to just save that for dinner. And then, girl, I don't even know. That's if I decide to eat that. But I do have that option. I don't know, girl. We'll just see how I'm feeling. But one thing that I do know is later on, your best friend, oh, girl, we're going to get some rest today because when I tell you, your best friend has been really busy. So, girl, listen, I think that's just about all I had to, you know, catch up with you on. Now, I'm about to go in here, of course, do my regular stuff, girl. I got to catch up on all these charts that you already know I haven't had the chance to write. And then, of course, do YouTube stuff, editing, you know, the blog that goes up for tomorrow. And that'll be it. So, I guess I'll just be back to show you what I'll be having on this update, girl. But, girl, we're going to try to get a little rest. Not only for the rest of this little lunch hour, but when I get home, girl, I hope the family knows mama is getting some rest so no girl check in let me know how your morning is going of course i hope you're having the most amazing day so far i guess i'll just be back to show you what my first meal will be for today on this update girl go ahead and check in 
It is about 2.30 and I'm ready to break my fast. So here will be my first meal on this update. So your girl is going in with the um, veggie bagel. Okay, so that is the everything in bagel. And it is some lettuce on here, tomatoes, some banana pepper, and cucumber. Yes, it comes with some barbecue chips. And yes, I'm going to eat that girl as well. And then I'm also going to add some green beans. Now this is part of what I had to bring for lunch today. But I don't know if, you know, just eating this will be enough so i just warm these up for just in case girl i probably will go ahead and eat them so this will be my um my first meal on today so girl let me go ahead try to eat this real quick because it'll be time to head back out to start seeing more patients hey girl so it is a little after six o'clock and as you can see your best friend has made it home from work and of course i am happy about it so i am so happy though the second part of my day you know like the afternoon part was not as busy you know as the first so yes girl because remember earlier i was like girl mm -mm, i'm coming home and sitting down which I'm, st I'm still gonna sit down okay but you know the afternoon was a little lighter so i was able to leave i went to go pick up y'all's nephew from aftercare and then and here we are now so a real quick story though so um he had a little gift waiting on him in the mail on today so last week you know um he was asking you know for this little special gift you know if he followed the directions and did good in school just all the things now girl you already know i bought my baby the little gift you want to know what it is what it was what well, is girl the little magic eight ball raise your hand if you know what i'm talking about girl the little thing we used to have back in the day you know you shake it up and it gives you the answer so i let him open up his his package and so we're in there and the first question that he asked that eight ball girl my baby said do I have the best mommy in the world? And then he turned it over and it said, absolutely, yes. And he said, see mom, they got it right. They said, absolutely, yes. Girl, y'all already know, girl, that just kind of melted my heart. So, um, yeah, girl, listen, stand up, mamas. Y'all know, girl, we don't play by our kids, okay? Do we? No, ma'am. So, I was just so happy to see that smile on his face, and little does he know, he definitely put a smile on mine. So, he's off, girl, upstairs playing with his little eight ball, okay? Um, as his little reward, um, I'll get in there to him and his little homework and things in just a moment. So, um, yeah, I've already come home. I've already set my workout clothes out. Out, got my scrubs together I do need to go up there and you know let Braylon know okay this will be your outfit for tomorrow so as far as my food for my second meal on this update girl I'm really not hungry right now and you already know girl that's usually how it is on my updates now you know um I already prepared my food remember like um I, I had brought it for lunch but then end up you know eating a different meal for lunch but I did eat the green beans but I'm still here thinking like girl I don't even know if I want you know what I had made girl I don't don't know the good thing is i do have a little time to just think about it because once again i'm not feeling super hungry like right now but we'll just see so i don't even know what i'll eat um you know here in the next little bit but of course i'll be back to show you so girl no i just want to go ahead pop in real quick say hey to my best friend catch you up you know on what's been going on today so i'm about to go upstairs just like i said go ahead get braylon situated with his clothes i guess i'll just be back to show you girl when i finally do decide what I'll be having for my second meal for today. So here's my second meal for today. So I have my cilantro lime rice, some vegan meatballs, and then just a vegetable medley of broccoli and carrots. Girl, you already know it was 10 out of 10. And here are my steps for the end of the day. I have had the most amazing day from doing the things I enjoy to eating the foods I love. Go ahead in the comments. Tell me one thing that has made your day amazing. Y'all already know what to do. Show your girl some love. Click the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell so you never miss a video from me. I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye.